After having been one of the most visited exhibitions in Paris in 2017, the Victoria and Albert Museum in London reveals their version of Christian Dior, designer of dreams. An immersion into the iconic French brand and highlighting Mr. Dior's fascination for British culture. Here we're focusing in really on the fashion element um, and we've reconfigured the show. We have about 60% new content um, and we've also added an extra, gal extra gallery which uh, focuses on Dior in Britain. Mr. Dior said, you know, there's, there's one country in the world which I love as much as my own and that's, that's Britain. And so he came to England when he was 21 and he spoke about it being a real time of freedom for him and he had quite a romantic notion of Britain so he loved the idea of aristocracy and, and royalty and he spoke about loving to see British women in their tweeds and their ball gowns. And so very, very rom romantic idea. Um, and of course he was delighted to dress Princess Margaret as one of his clients. There were 15 of us. He wanted models of all types and of all shapes and sizes because his clients varied in size. And they were, after all, the largest part of his income and his work. I had a beautiful evening dress and he said to me, Madam, this dress suits you very well. I'm going to take it off you and put it on someone else because he wanted to focus on the dress and not the person wearing it and he had every reason to do this. He was more than just a boss. He really was a man that we loved a lot. It was a family. really proud and also in Brazil just a little bit me to be part of this big uh, heritage uh, with other great designers, not only Mr. Dior of course. All the different uh, designer was uh, right for the time that they was in charge of the Christian Dior house and that's mean to maintain life uh, a brand. Uh, I think it's very important to make that because it's a big value, the brand. And this kind of exhibition, uh, in my point of view, are very corporate because in any case, Dior is a, a worldwide brand. And uh, around the world, do you remember Dior? <laughs>